Major Vishal Bakshi, VSM, retired, Managing Director of the VR Industries, Private Limited, Lieutenant General Rajesh Kocher, Senior Director, Jildi, Officers from the Government of uh, Odisha, and my dear colleagues of JGU. I take this uh, privilege to welcome you all for this uh, valedictory function of this program, five-day program on uh, leadership development, stress management, and performance enhancement. The program was a five-day program which uh, started on Monday. And uh, after a hectic and a very grueling schedule, we have come to the close of the program today. The program encompassed a sightseeing trip, oblique a field trip to Kurukshetra, which happened yesterday evening only. And uh, today we have got together for the valedictory address. It's always a, a moment of uh, pleasure as well as a saddening moment when the valedictory happens because uh, we feel that uh, we have completed a program but at the same time, we get involved with the participants and it becomes a routine for us, which comes to an end. I am grateful and thankful to all the participants for their cooperation, which they've extended in making this uh, program a success for us. And as always, we hope that you go back with some takeaways. You're all senior officers in your fields. So there is uh, nothing we can teach you, but definitely knowledge is always welcome. And uh, I'm sure we would have been able to make some impression and there would be some takeaways which you take away with you, which would help you in your place of work. Uh, to take the program forward, I would uh, request our senior director, Lieutenant General Rajesh Kocher, to please give the welcome address. Good afternoon, ladies and gentlemen. First and foremost, a uh, very, very hearty welcome to Major Vishal Bakshi, which is Seva Medal. Uh, who's our chief guest today? He's the chairman of VR Industries, Colonel Mathur on the dais, uh, the participants from the government of West Bengal, the teams from the back end, that is the events team, the logistic team, the Jildi team, and of course, uh, the, all those who are present today. Government of West Bengal. Government of please. I'm sorry. We've just been talking to government of West Bengal, so it's there in the mind here. Yeah, I'm sorry. We're just talking to them because they've got some uh, programs launched out and they're going next month. Sorry, my, my apologies. Anyway, uh, it's, it's always a great pleasure to have a, a, a visitor and a prominent visitor come to us to grace the occasion as a chief guest. And I have my friend and dear colleague from the Indian Army, Major Vishal Bakshi, who is a Territorial Army officer. He's the Managing Director of VR Industries Limited. He's a management gra graduate from IMT Ghaziabad and completed his graduation from Hansraj College, uh, New Delhi, and also schooling from Modern School Delhi. He's a dynamic professional and multifaceted personality with an illustrious stint in the Indian Territorial Army. He holds the distinction of being the only major in the Territorial Army to have been bestowed a Vishisava Medal. That's a great honor for the matter to get a Vishisava Medal at the rank of a major is something very unique. Yeah, he was also awarded an Army Chief's Commendation card as a lieutenant. He is a passionate golfer and a humanitarian. I must also tell you that Major Bakshi is an artist and uh, he's acted in three movies as a, as a star and done a few movies in Bollywood. So for that matter, he is the only actor in the history of Bollywood to have become an Army officer. So I'm just telling you that he's a very unique personality who has had the best of both worlds from the industry uh, to uh, Bollywood to the becoming an army officer. A success, successful entrepreneur, he created the brand ATM, a made in India serial, having started with a single product that is Conflix, his flagship company that is VR Industries Private Limited is one of the Indian food companies with, with an extensive range of breakfast cereal products. For the matter, they are, they are supplying cereals to many countries now. He was just telling me he has come back from Tashkent yesterday, that is in Uz Uzbekistan. And uh, they have just uh, closed a deal with the government of Uzbekistan to, to supply breakfast cereals to some of the stores there. 
The company's uh, brand ATM is one of the most preferred brands among families of Indian Armed Forces personnel at the Canteen Store Department, which is one of the largest organized retail chains in Asia. Besides its foray in retail and modern trade, the company has made its presence felt in the Middle East and neighboring countries in breakfast cereal segment. His motto is success, hard work, success is hard work, constant innovation and undeterred commitment and to itself. Under his leadership and guidance, the company is now making its global presence felt. So we, we extend a very hearty welcome to Major Vishal Bakshi for gracing the occasion. Thank you very much. And of course, uh, I'm sure uh, he will c continue his uh, association with the university after this day. I also would like to uh, welcome Mr. Rishi Pandey, his manager, who has accompanied him, and he is also there for, present for this validity function. Well, uh, well, officers from the government of Orissa, like I said, it's always a very sentimental journey for us because we started uh, the complete executive education with the government of Orissa on the 13th of July 2013 and I think somebody was here who came for the first course. Who was that? Prasanna? Prasanna. You came for the very first course. Yeah. And, uh, sorry? 2013. July 2013 to be exact. I still remember that Mr. Dalai Lama's birthday was somewhere in that during that course. So we celebrated that. And, uh, and we are very grateful to the government of West Bengal. Correction, I keep going back because just because the government of Orissa, because you are the pioneers and trend makers. For the matter, you started the uh, foreign programs also with us. We have done nearly six programs, both for the uh, Oxford University and also the uh, program with the Lee Kuan Yew School of Public Policy. And I'm sure uh, with our continued persistence and uh, presence, your government will also take up this again and uh, make sure that some of these courses in the, are repeated both with the LKY school and uh, uh, London School of Economics of Lake Oxford University. For the matter, uh, we are now taking programs to the uh, London School of Economics. We are having a program for the West Bengal government in, in the month of January. We are having a program, two programs with the Lee Kuan Yew School of Public Policy in November and December. So I'm sure your government will also follow suit and do the needful. Uh, what is uh, the best part about uh, the government of Orissa officers? I must share that with you. I always feel government of Orissa officers are very nice, very well behaved, very disciplined and very organized. We have done so many programs, more than 450 officers have come through the portals of this uh, university and uh, I find them very pleasant and very nice to, to organize and uh, to conduct. Well, I was very, uh, I was uh, very dismayed yesterday when we got information that Shivani has got some injury to her ankle. I hope you are well, uh, okay, ma'am, and you will you'll be there to undertake your chuti after this. I hope so, both of you, it, it is Shiri and uh, Shivani. But uh, but you have, people have conducted yourself in a very gracious manner, and uh, that is what the report I am going to give. You have been very nice very very responsive very organized and very very cooperative so thank you very much it's always like they say that you clap with both hands so you need the other hand also to clap and we are the other hand so we try and put our best foot forward and i do hope you had a wonderful uh, visit to kurukshetra yesterday followed by this lovely parathas at murthal so i mean these are small little uh, i would say uh, flares in the program, but uh, it's very important for you to get the content right. And all of you have been responsive right from my class in the for the first class, which I normally take for the programs. I find you very responsive, very organized, and uh, very. Uh, it is very very nice to conduct such uh, officers. So thank you very much. Uh, you are all going back home, so have a safe journey. But all those except those three officers who have done the program earlier were repeaters. I would like to tell you that you all become the alumni of this university. And once you become the alumni, you have you can use all the facilities of the university, keeping you the library. The you can come and stay here. It's it's very very reasonable to come and stay here, and you can bring your family and you can see the good food which is available. 
the verdant campus, the greenery, and uh, as you are aware that we have Swachh Bharat number one, so the cleanest campus, campus in the country, so all that. So come and enjoy the, this thing because many times five to six days is not enough to see the whole campus. But uh, whenever you want to come, some of you have got your niche areas where you would like to lecture. So you can do that and uh, come and uh, speak to us about it. You can take part in a program for the matter we have got. Uh, Mr. Rautrai, who has been coming very uh, regularly, uh, who is the OST to the Chief Secretary. I think he is still there, isn't it? Yeah. Probably he must be the third or fourth Chief Secretary he is seeing. I think so. Yeah. Before Mr. Party also. Sorry? Third one. Yeah. Gokul Pati, yes. Yeah. So, so he comes here. Uh, and uh, so any of you want to come and uh, lecture us on your niche areas, you're most welcome. So thank you very much once again. And I once again thank uh, Major Vishal Bakshi, Vishish Sama Medal, to come and grace this occasion. And wish all the participants a very safe journey home. And thank you for being with us. And we look forward to many more such programs from the government of Orissa. And uh, we wish you all the very best. Jai Hind. Thank you, sir, for that uh, welcome note. Uh, without taking any time, I would now request our Honorable Chief Guest, uh, Major Bakshi, VSM, to please come and give the valedictory address. A very good afternoon to all of you. Um, firstly, I would like to thank General Kocha, sir, Colonel Mathur, sir, for giving me an opportunity to be here amongst all you talented, experienced people. Um, well, I'm, I'm happy to be here because I'd heard a lot about this university and coming here today, seeing it personally is a big eye-opener, being ranked amongst top eight universities in the country. And I find everyone very fortunate who are studying here or who've come here for courses because um, one thing is very simple, education has no age. And uh, I feel that at any given point of time, no matter what our age is and no matter how well educated we are, Sikhna or Sikh kabhi bhi mil sakti hai. So, and I think I was just going through the program which, which was conducted for all of you people in the last five, six uh, days. <coughs> it's been quite extensive. It has covered a couple of things. And Colonel Mathur was just uh, updating me that how important each one of you sitting here in the state handling key areas, the so-called key holders and the key working team people are here. So I'm sure with this course of uh, a week that you've spent here will definitely enhance your own abilities and your own creativity in your own areas. And you can further, you know, take this back home in your own departments. Uh, well, I am, I think uh, some of you here are as old as I am, or maybe older, more experienced, but I have realized that uh, uh, learning is something that you can learn from an eight-year-old, stroke an eight-year-old. And a classic example I'll share with you is when I joined the armed forces, uh, I thought golf was uh, a game which is you know, 50 years ke ho jao, zindagi mein kuch na ho golf khelo. This was my thought process. And suddenly, uh, one day at a driving range, I saw an eight-year-old kid hitting the ball. And that was an eight-year-old girl. The way she was hitting the ball was so amazing. And that really fascinated me. And I was standing right next to her. I saw her stance. And the ball was going straight. Her father was right there. And I realized that, you know, it's a game which is played and the only game which you're playing with your own self, with your own mindset. And I said, okay, let me try my hand. And I realized, well, no, golf is not a game to be played at 50, 55, 60. You can actually start playing now. So uh, that was one learning step in life. Secondly, I've always felt that either you're a born leader or you craft yourself to leadership. Because each one of us sitting here 
हैव द एबिलिटी टू बी अ लीडर इन आर ओन जोन इन आर ओन स्फेयर इट्स जस्ट दैट आर वी एबल टू टैप दैट क्वालिटी ऑफ लीडरशिप इन आस सम ऑफ आस आर एबल टू टैप सम ऑफ आस आर नॉट एंड देन सम वन नेक्स्ट टू आस इज हलो यू हैव द एबिलिटी यू हैव द क्रिएटिविटी इन यू इट्स जस्ट दैट यू नीड टू वर्क ऑन दैट सो आई हैव I have seen that in my own life that any profession you may belong to the key is honesty honesty to your own self integrity to your own self bachpan mein sunte the is hindi okay with some people right bachpan mein hum log sunte the padhte the ki khud ko agar hum sahi rakhe to sab kuch theek ho jata hai but hota kya hai you know when you 14 15 16 we we read a lot we hear a lot when we go to school uh but duniya mein phir kuch aise pehlu ho jate hain which changes our personality thought process but the key remains the same and which is honesty to your own self if you are disciplined people around you automatically get disciplined and we've seen some fantastic examples in the past we are lucky to be born as indians we are lucky to be here in this country which has given us classic examples so if we look at history i'm sure you people would have known history better than me so i'm not going to take any names but we just look at their career path their sacrifice so in leadership another very important aspect is sacrifice a person if he or she has the ability to be magnanimous the ability to sacrifice the ability to give something is is on a path of leadership because uh, it's not that you are highly educated and you're a leader i'm sorry i mean i may disagree there uh, authority can give you position but a leader is a person who can take his team along with him who can make his people work with him who has the ability to listen to his own flaws with his team members and was able to improve himself so i have been able to craft those points in my own life i'm a i'm a very small uh, uh, entity in this country so it has been very gracious to speak few high words about me but somewhere down the line i think if one is able to contribute whatever one has learned uh, whether to your own society to your own set of people we belong to a beautiful country with fantastic people i think the beauty of india is different states different mindsets yet when everything gets combined together makes us fantastic and army i i i have a son he's he's uh, going to be 18 and i've always told him since he was 12 you will join the territorial army you will don the uniform and he's pretty much settled and uh, the only reason i think is that in our country um, army is one of the best organization which teaches you camaraderie which teaches you discipline which teaches you um leadership no better organization uh, teaches you leadership than the indian armed forces and which is globally accepted so ladies and gentlemen uh, i'm just here to be a part of you people i thought i'll be here to learn a few things from you that you have uh, understood in last 5 6 days and if i get an opportunity to be in your state and to be of any help and support i would really appreciate it and uh, thank you for having me here and it's it's already 1:30 or 1:40 in the afternoon and i'm sure each one of you would be very hungry for lunch as well <coughs> so without taking much of your time um anything that you want to ask i'm very happy to answer but thank you for being here and congratulations of each one of you on completion of your course and thank you sir for having me here uh, thank you sir for those uh, words of wisdom on leadership and uh, life in general We're really grateful to you uh before we move on to the uh, distribution of the certificates we will request uh, mr swain from the uh, course to come up and say a few words on behalf of the program it is very difficult to start uh, having three one major one lieutenant general and lieutenant colonel in das so thank you sir for giving this opportunity to thank you all first of all i would like to thank my government of odisha who has sent me to this uh, to such an opportunity to be in the <coughs> world top ranking institution to have a training course of such kind 
I was really impressed, influenced, and uh, really it has uh, it has mattered a lot to me being part of this university for last five six years. So I have been quite uh, from the <coughs> from the uh, very first day. Uh, Lieutenant General Rajesh Kochar has taken that class where he could find the difference uh, between Ambani and Tata, what they are vision. Like, uh, um, when Ambani is, can be a good party, can be a good in the, uh, businessman, whereas uh, Tata is an industrialist. And I, I want my country to be <coughs> not rich, but a happy country. And what about uh, military leadership? What is PDM, PPM? purpose, direct, direction, motivation, all that, to, <coughs> to subjective well-being of Titi Bhatnagar ma'am, all AAA series, awareness, acceptance, action. From Prajesh Kumar, we learn about personal finance management. From KK Pandey sir, we learn managerial effectiveness. Dr. Sanjeev Sahani has taken a whole day long class of stress management and performance linked how to en enhance your performance. Tonusri Sarma ma'am have taken two very important and very educative classes, leadership essentials and situational analysis. Today, after attending her class only, we came here. She was really wonderful. She was really, I, <coughs> I, took, uh, I took note of uh, her classes actually. One ball exercise she, she made in the class. It was very much interesting and learning too. All of us have learned a lot. It was quite inspirative and educative. And uh, from Manjushri Palit, we learned about emotional intelligence. From Rajesh Chakravarti, we learned how to transform a state. He has given an example of the example of Bihar state. So many new new words have uh, <coughs> uh, have been uh, taught in this class, and I, I will go with those new words like being empathetic. It's a new word to, to made an exercise on that word particularly. Emotional intelligence. What you take away from this course? What is happiness bank? So many new things, new things, new concepts have been added to my intelligence here. And I'm really looking forward to a very good, uh, it, will, it will helpful in my future course of action being in the, I am with my, <coughs> and uh, you know, my leader is from military base. He's a captain, he's also a captain. So all matching with, uh, uh, my, mini my I, am a, I am private secretary to Honorable Minister Home. Uh, he is a captain of the Air Force uh, for a long, long time, and he was, after that he becomes a commercial pilot to three minist chief minister of uh, Chhattisgarh State. He is captain Deepya Sangar, he is captain Deepya Sangar Mr. So I will also share with some of the good teachings uh, to him only. So thanks a lot, sir. It's a wonderful institution and we are really proud of you. And uh, every time I, I, last two, three years, I was struggling to have uh, entered my name here to be uh, part of this institution. But uh, now I could uh, smell why Sivani has every time, uh, every time he, he, he tried to get into the list and he, three times he has, he has won to get into the list and now, sorry to say that she has uh, injured her ankle uh, yesterday, but we will go, go away with a huge memory, sir. It's a huge campus. I have enjoyed playing TT. I have enjoyed playing table tennis with my, my, my awesome, my handsome young chap, Asis. And I, I, sorry to say, I, yesterday, whole day, I teased Pratap. <laughs> Hope you will not mind after, after this session, you will forget what bucket is. <laughs> Let's not. <laughs> we have, we have had, had a good bucket uh, exercise yesterday, but we will forget it. It's a part of enjoyment only. But <clears throat> I have also enjoyed a beautiful gymnastics gym also, with my very young, uh, my alumni, Nagbusa. It was really fantastic. Uh, we have uh, the uh, meals are awesome, the classes are awesome, very well organized, composed, the faculties are simply brilliant. I, 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 I am giving a heads up to them. It's wonderful. Sir. Really proud of the institution. Looking forward to have another time here. Thank you. Thank you, sir, for those uh, kind words and uh, we thank the complete course for uh, the feeling. It is really very encouraging for us when we hear these words because uh, this is uh, what we look for in return and we are grateful to you and we hope that uh, the association continues with the government of uh, Odisha and uh, we do many more programs for you and continue to satisfy you. Mm -hmm.